Hey guys, Noir here, back on the 5'9 channel, um, a mobile channel, and uh, the theme of the video is Noir has no shame. Isn't that right, Hydros? Yeah, we might as well open up an OnlyFriends <laughs> account yeah. at this point yeah. for Noir to play these games, because it looks like it's just downhill for 5'9 five mo five mobile. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, look, look. Uh, this game is 7 Mortal Sins X to C. And um, I'm sure you could clearly see the name, but Seven Mortal Sins is the IP. Uh, it's got an anime for one season, and it's got a manga. It is a little, little risque, but not fully risque, if you know what I mean. Um, the, you know, the, the devs know that, so they made their own version, which I, I'm not going to get into. Just saying it's out there. So anyways, um, the game's a waifu collector, as you can uh, see. And I'm going to go through it because it came out two weeks ago and initially I was like, it's a little too risky, but it's actually a lot of fun. Like people told me, try the game out and I tried it and they're right. I have actually quite enjoyed it. I've been playing it consistently for the last two weeks. So I figured new banner came out today. Um, why not cover the game and talk about it and my experience for the last two weeks and I'm still in the honeymoon phase or whatever phase this is. So anyways, long story short. You've got five stars, four stars, and three stars in this game. Um, the art is interesting. Very, I think uh, Hyde just was saying it looks very Persona esque, and I think like I around where the text is, like around the like a lot of the text has like that Persona style. Right. Uh, not on this page specifically. I think it was more or less on the home page and some other other screen. Like, I guess like yeah, like where it says go guild relic cast. That kind of reminds me of a little bit of it. Uh, yeah, like so the way Persona does their, their and the, and the music too, which unfortunately Hydros can't hear the music, but when you guys hear it, it'll remind you of Persona. So, uh, yeah, so there's rarities of three, four, five. Three stars are strictly fodder. So units like let's say Leviathan, I I pulled her. She starts off at level fifty, but you can the three stars are fodder to upgrade to like limit breaker, right, or level breaker, whatever you want to call it. So here I feed her a little bit. She broke from fifty to fifty five. And the max I could do right now is 80. The uh, what to get to 80, I have to feed all these things, and then on top of that, rank her from four star, a uh, five star to six. And I need this cur um, material to do it. And there we go. So, lots of things to do for her. Um, and then of course uh, level her herself. And then there's skills. Now this is where I would say the game is if you want to be the best, you got to be pretty whaley. But that's kind of the case no matter what. Um, you need 15 dupes. Now, I pulled a legit one dupe of her, and that skill up only counts for one. But this thing here is, is a grimoire. It's a character-specific grimoire, but it's one of the grimoires. And you can say, once I clicked it, it's now 8 out of 9. If I hit skill up, that'll go through. So, technically, the bare minimum you need to pull to max out a unit is 6 dupes. And then you can use, and this is free-to-play friendly, the grimoires. You can use the grimoires to up the rest of it. So... Again, that's where I feel a little, little bit off about that. But however, um, lots of systems to go through, like the character progression and stuff like that. This Leviathan, she's kind of a, one of the main side characters in the game, um, in the anime, I want to say. Uh, this karma system is essentially akin to um, like relationships or stuff like that. Um, you break karma, you get some, you know, currency, you get some extra HP, some attacks, some extra stats. And um, the last thing I want to show is the equipment. Now, this is, I'll get to star shards and soul mirrors, but star shards are essentially like pieces of things you can farm. And this is very much like Epic 7, where every piece um, ranges in the quality and then the type of stat substats. So this SR shard has a plus 10 attack, plus 7 defense. But if I go to this one here, it's got crit and defense, and the set is crit plus 8. So. You're going to be farming for a specific set. Then you want specific subs, sub stats. Obviously, you want an LR version. And I think this is an LR version. We get four sub stats. And then you go f uh, rank up the gear from 0 to 15. And every three levels, you increase one of the sub stats. So in this case, in an LR, uh, for who's, it's equipped on Raphael. She, she's a fast character. So I want speed and you know attack. Well, I leveled up to plus 9. I got no rank ups in attack. It's kind of terrible. So I would have to farm again to get the right. So it's a forever farming system where you're going to be hoping for the right drop, hoping for the right subsets to drop, and then hoping for the right subsets to upgrade when you max out the thing. 
and then give it to your to your unit. So that's where there's a lot to do in the game. It's there's forever grind. That's how I describe it. Soul mirrors. I don't have any soul mirrors for her, but um, there's character specific soul shards. It's the best way to describe or star shards, um, and uh, you need those to get the other illustrations, if you know what I mean. Um, so th that's just putting it out there. Just putting it out there. Like for example, uh, Lucifer. I will just quickly show you what I'm talking about. Yeah. See. See. Yeah. You get other illustrations. Um. So th there. So. <laughs> Anyways. Um. And Alar single-handedly took down our channel. Yes, yes. So anyways, <laughs> going back through all this stuff, there's a lot of things to do, right? Um, it is kind of whaling in the sense that there are differences between paid crystals and non-paid crystals. So uh, again, lots of things, lots of like events and missions to do, but the downside would be this stuff here. Like these things that you could buy, which you obviously need, or if you want to max out a unit, uh, these are paid crystals only. That's kind of the downside of things. Um, the gotcha... The cool thing is, uh, obviously, I've already done it, but daily, they give you a free single on all the banners. So every banner gets a f daily free single, and the rates aren't so bad. So, like, this is the new banner that came out. Let's take a look at the rates. Five stars uh, in, <coughs> in general are 2.25 or 3.25, right, when you go from Sins, Rider, Awaken. Um, and then 10% for four stars, and then 86.75 for the others. And the whole point is... Um, you know, on a multi summon, you're guaranteed at least a four star. So I've gotten super lucky where I've had three or four, five stars in one multi, and then I've gotten shafted before where all I get are three stars and then one four star, right? So the bare minimum. Um, but before we get into the summons, which, uh, you know, I love summoning, I just knows that the best. Uh, let's go and play, oops, not the gotcha, just got out of that. Uh, let's go play the game and show you what it looks like. So it's a turn based chibi art style. And again, I'm not a big fan of Chibi, but to be fair, um, if it's got some good uh, aesthetics, like people, you could tell they like really care and put a lot of effort into it. I'm usually not too scuffed about it. Um, okay, so let's get her. Ugh. I want more red, huh? Yeah, so there's a Trinity system here, right? Red, blue, and green. I'm sure you can figure out what does what to whom. Um, let's just go here. Uh, so we'll start off with manual gameplay for the first wave. And then after that, I'll put on auto just to clear it out. And yeah, like there's a lot of um, the daily dungeons have tickets. So you don't use stamina. You use stamina for sh star shard farming and uh, the campaign or whatever event that's happening. Okay, so I'm going to take it off auto. Of course, this is the first attack. There's an AoE that kills a bunch of people and then hits them again. That's why Lucifer is so strong because she starts off like that from the get-go. Hot Spring looks like so much fun. There's even a water slide. And, uh, you know, she... I wonder what that's is. for, Nolar. What do you think it's for? <laughs> <laughs> no. It's so hot here and my throat is parched. I need some icy cool milk. Like, right is now. Is it? Is you parched? I can't imagine why. What do, do you, you want to, to, to fill she, that She wanted thirst? milk. She wanted milk. That's why she asked for. Oh, uh, uh, milk. This makes yes. things difficult for a mommy, you know. Okay. Why did you have to throw that in there? <laughs> All right. Let me do a manual thing. All right. So clearly this will give you an idea of what they do. Uh, she's a red unit. Going to attack a green unit. Do more damage. One shot it. Again, this is normal mode. Not going to be difficult. But the actual, like, these do get very difficult. Like, they do, they actually do get real hard. And um, to restar and, like, auto skip. Oh, there's no auto. There's no... um skip tickets but there is like offline farming so you could say like hey just use up all my stam for this thing and then it'll say oh it'll be done in like three hours so that's what i mean like it's this feels like a side game where you could let it auto farm offline come back three hours later and then get all the, the loot and all the materials yep this is lucifer doing her thing she just yes, literally wrecked everybody <laughs> ruining the innocence of everybody everywhere is what she's doing yeah pretty pretty damn look away look away <laughs> okay so um yeah so that's the combat oh, get that out later um so that's the combat and that's the stamina 
And stamina refills are actually limited per day. There's no like, you have to spend currency and it's limited. Um, but they give you lots of stuff, lots of stam up front, like lots of, you know, here's a hundred stam for logging in after 2 p.m. or whatever the case may be. So you get that going, you do your dailies, you know, you get that done. Um, yeah, so I've got some dailies left, but there's a lot of achievements and the game is pretty heavy on PVP. That's, that's the one thing. Um, I don't want to show you a match. I do want to summon and get this over with. Want to pull more Beelzebub. I've got a few Leviathans, so I would like to please <laughs> make this easy, not difficult. Ah, damn it. No heart. There's no heart. I mean, you could still. still you could still. Yeah. Maybe. So, I mean, you got the rainbow sphincter down there, so it's. I don't know what that means. I swear to God, I, I see, see there's blue. blue. I saw. There I saw go. blue. I okay, so so purple is three star, yellow is four star, blue is a five star. That's why I'm like, oh, I want to see a blue. It was a not. It was a questionable shot of that image. More importantly, they're fodder. They're all fodder. Come on, fodder. The collector in me would at least keep one of each for some reason. Even if they oh, are. Oh, okay. There's a blue. Learning how to let Let me join go. in learning. Ooh. Oh, it's her. Famine. Ooh. Eh. Famine. Yeah. Aren't you a little parched too, Hydros? You, you need a little milk yourself? Um, I mean, I, that did quench a little bit of my thirst. <laughs> so, um, uh, you know what? I might do a PvP match because the game is pretty heavy on PvP. I might just show it to you. I have been on a winning streak, so there is that. Is it live um, PvP? It's not live PvP, but it, it, it the, really like arena. It. It's arena, yeah, it's arena. Oh, uh, I don't bad. know what. I don't mind. Though. I I don't know what this one is. Grand Coliseum, fifteen v fifteen raid mode, best of three multi party that match. Does not I have sound no like clue. a fun time. <laughs> to be yeah, honest. I have no idea. Uh, but let's do something that I know I can like this one I know with this setup. Yeah, with this setup I can definitely do that. So loading's a little a little weird, but the fluidity of the gameplay itself when you lot like go in and play, it's pretty good. And yeah, I mean Chibi, not again, I'm not a huge fan, but the fact that they put this much effort into like the intro animation, that's pretty good. So hers went first. She's going to wreck me for a little bit. Hopefully I sustain the onslaught and then I could, you know. You know, in this type of game, it's okay if they wreck you, stomp on you, sit on you, whatever. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> of course. This is the Hydro system here. Got it. Okay. Damn it. And they're going to go again. Yeah. All right. So let's get rid of you. I don't know if there's a one shot. I'm definitely not installing this game. Just to let you know. Yeah, and you're, you're definitely getting the one from Google Play. It's not the super sure. secret APK. Definitely not that one. <laughs> yes. So, yeah. Again, okay, I've been playing for two weeks, so I kind of know how the, the meta or how things are going to go. So, like, the reason why Fur Furka, she's so great, if you read this, it deals damage and has a chance to increase random move gauge on the ally so they can move faster. So, let's target her. Do good damage. Uh, that, that nullified. Uh, cool. So yeah, again, this is like manual play. You can auto skip it if you want, but then if if it's a questionable matchup you, and you want to win it, obviously you want to play it manually. God damn, her Lucifer is back. In more ways than one. Yeah, my Raphael though. I almost killed her. Almost. Yeah. This game does use live 2D that I've uh, come to yeah, figure out. Yeah, it does. Out. Yeah, it uses live 2D, and the live 2D is great. The chibi models are interesting. Like I said, just well Massive produced. Pain to actually get those to replicate. <laughs> right. Not that I so, would know. <laughs> yeah, I just would know. So, anyways, that's the PvP portion, guys. Um, and the reason why it's such a big deal is because you get dupes of characters, right? So that's why they want you to farm this. Um, unfortunately, like the sins, the mortal sins, so like Lucifer and Asmodeus and all those other ones, uh, you can't get them here, but the 
the other characters you can. And so like Furka, this girl, the Dragon Blade. I've been trying to, I've been farming the hell out of her. I think she's like at like plus eight or something. Yeah, plus eight. I've been dumping everything I can in her. Uh, she's great. So anyways, Hydros, we'll final thoughts on the game. Make jokes. But uh, I mean, it looks cool. I mean, I'm, I'm definitely gonna give it a, a shot, if you will. Um, but no, I'm not gonna spend no money on it. But I would be a nice. Y'all know what's up. I don't even have to explain myself. Yeah, you don't. You <laughs> it looks really cool. Don't. I wanted to cool. show them the the heart animation, uh, but. Okay, you can do one more. And. Uh, could, but I need that to farm. I saw blue again. All right, guys. I always like to end it on a multi. Here we are. A jellyfish with, with, with knockers. I didn't think I ever expect I'd see that in my life. <laughs> Just to let you know. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Where's the blue? Probably the very last one, yeah. Well. Maybe. Oh, well, it's not the Sins. Foxy Scryer. She's new. I never had her before, so she's a new character. Oh, uh, that reminds me. The reason else is also Whaley is the Sopedia wants you to collect every unit, and it gives you stats to collect them. So there's that. That'll give me the edge in Arena. So, all right, guys. Um, this is Seven Mortal Sins uh, Ecstasy. It is definitely a different type of game. Uh, you can download it on the app store and play store so you know you, you know this is compliant to long the, the, their rules there are other versions out there just that's all i'm gonna say um you let us know your thoughts down below i know it's been out for a bit but i definitely wanted to showcase like i have been playing it i've enjoyed it it's kind of it is fun i'm not gonna lie so uh let us know what your thoughts are share this with your friends share with your uh i, I guess don't share this with your mom i normally would say that but don't share this one with your mom uh, definitely share with your friends though. Uh, and if you're new here and want to see more 5.9 mobile gaming, gotcha gaming, definitely hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, give us a like, and let us know your thoughts. Me and Hydros, catch you on the next one. See ya.